Greetings and welcome back to Not Tonight 2. I'm Catherine of Sky and remember this is an open beta of this game. Just head on out to the developers discord where they will give you a key if you want to play this weekend. Anyway, we have been in Montana uh, freezing a tiny bit and having a beautiful cute roadkill hat a tiny bit and we were going to leave and go to the next location which hopefully should be New Camelot. So let's go. New Camelot. This trip was getting real weird, real fast. I jumped as a drone flew close. It dropped a package into my arms. Oh, that's from Mappo. Hooray! <laughs> Thanks. Fulfilling Mappo Quest help us, helps us reestablish liberty in America. Mappo Quest, one success. You aced a job and got the varmint hat, or found it another way. You gained money 100. Mapo Quest 2 success. You helped a team. You gained health 20. Hooray! Mapo Quest 3 success. You remember George's last name. You gained morale 20. Okay, cool. Grade A achieved. Location bonus unlocked. Received outfit Canada jacket. Oh, yeah. Oh, is that the Canada jacket? Hey. I wonder if that's like. I want to wear that. Yeah. And I also want to wear the hat. Yeah. Not together, apparently. Okay, let's wear the jacket. That's nice. It's got a maple leaf on the front of it. Okay. I pulled over for gas on my way out of Billings. Gas to New Camelot, $100 one day. 337 miles to this New Camelot thing. I drove southeast. I drove southeast and we are... We are walking quite, quite drivingly. <laughs> I would really love to see cars here. It's so silly. <laughs> oh my God. The snowy plains of Montana faded into the sprawling stretch of South Dakota. Oh, and in case you uh, didn't realize, I live in just south of here in Wyoming land, actually, uh, currently. So I'm, I'm, I find all of this very amusing. Time for a restroom stop. I pulled up to a building with peeling paint and boarded up windows. Wait, what did we get here? Oh, we got a texture message. Let's just see that. Mary, and thanks for letting Shannon in. She said to forward you this. Nice, thanks. She's under 21. You know that, right? I know. I'm worried. I just keep trying to help her. Okay, she knows Shannon as well. Shannon is, if you played the first game, she is the perpetual teenage wanting to get into bars and pubs and all the things and yeah it's rough okay kenya hey kev i'm getting someone from mapo to call you hey kenya what's mapo they can help you travel okay i guess now she tells me mm -hmm. okay so we have what is this this is money okay i always want to check everything just in case we miss something like you know george's last name or something okay the sign reads Bo's Diner. Used to be Bobby's Diner before <laughs> the letters fell off. Ain't that the truth, though? <laughs> it looked far more murder shack than diner. Oh, no. But nature was calling. I went inside and did my business. When I came out, a greasy man jabbed a finger at a sign that read, Restrooms for customers only. I took a seat. The only item on the menu was soup. The greasy man waited for my order. Oh, the Discord says don't eat the soup. Get stall for time. The man disappeared back into the kitchen. I scanned the rest of the diner. Two of the customers were slumped forward in their booth. Sleeping in here? The air was smoky. The heat from the kitchen unbearable. Can I just leave him a tip or something? Two similarly greasy men emerged to drag one of the customers into the kitchen. I watched out of the corner of my eye. I quickly left as they disappeared through the door. I bet they're making soup out of the customers. I ran straight for the car and scrambled for my keys. I didn't look up, pulled away from the diner. After half an hour, an hour, I pulled up, cranked down the window, and puked. Ugh. What was that place? I knew things were going too well. I continued driving. We, we continued <laughs> driving. <laughs> driving! Driving looks like this. <laughs> Oh god, that's funny. 
All right, we're almost in New Camelot, which Mount Rushmore has been changed, evidently. I've never been to Mount Rushmore. I should go. Finally, I arrived in New Camelot. What do we got here? What's going on here? What? Hello? 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 Do we see anything different? No? Nothing here? Okay. Let's look. See what happened. Two jobs. $200 to leave. I have enough money. Tons. Find info on George. We have... Okay. Perfect knights. One shall pass. Wizard. There are things here that sound very interesting. Okay, texter. Who is calling me? Is anybody? No. Hello? Nai? Okay. Don't know what that is. So nothing there. False test text message alarm. Let's explore New Camelot. I had arrived in New Camelot. When democracy collapsed, it gave rise to a variety of factions. From my new home in Seattle, a semi-functional society to the martyr territories modeled on a fascist state. Wait, we entered the U.S. again, right? Why was there no border control? Confusion. Okay, then there was New Camelot. Anglophiles and medieval fantasy book nerds banded together and carved out a place to live their fantasies 24-7. Oh my god. The Camelot Lunch, Lunch Theater took prime position where the Mount Rushmore viewing terrace used to be. In and out went the knights, each bearing different emblems and colors. The one exception was a scraggly bearded man dressed in tattered wizard's robes. He was turned away at the door. <gasps> Why? This must be the wizard the teen mentioned. I called out to the man. Hey, wizard! Show level five mage! <laughs> oh god, this is fun. Mages are not the same as wizards. Just making sure everybody knows. Wizard! Nay, sell sword, address me correctly! Hey, mage. Better, sell sword. Better. But how art thou speaking to me? Did one break my level three cloaking spell? Uh, I could see you leaving. I see, I see. Dispel magic. Well met. Always good to run into a fellow magician. Sure. I'm looking for a George Suarez. Do you know him? George, yes. A very good friend of the mages. Say, art thou a sellsword like he? I use Bouncer. <laughs> Huzzah! That means you can get me into the hallowed halls of Camelot. I need to know where George is. One helps a mage in time of need, and a mage will help you in return. Take the bouncer job tonight. They'll tell you to only let knights in. But you see me and let you in. Then you tell me about George? Of course. I'll meet you back here in the morning. Joe was right. A bouncer job opening. Guess this was my best lead on George for now. Uh-huh. Right. Okay, so we got our wizard stamp here. Let's talk to Bouncer. All right, Camelot Night 1. We have a two, two skull difficulty. America's best and only medieval experience. All right, we need to, 11 to pass, 14 to win. Hello, I'm here for the Bouncer job. Oh, this is Lord Lupo. How nice. If you intend to work here, you will address me as Lord. Okay, sure, Lord. That's my lord to you. Oh, I'm so sick of hiring outside help. Regardless, we shall make it work. Any special rules tonight? No minors and look out for fake IDs. You need to check date of birth, expiry, photo, and that the hologram is present and correct. <laughs> That's very British. That's funny. Wow, is that all? And no wizards. They are a scourge to the realm. What about mages? They're all the same buffoons. Mages, wizards, witches, druids, conjurers. They have even started to fly in via balloon to avoid the queue. If you spot one, show no weakness. Hit them with a spear. Is that legal? Do not question your lord, sellsword. Wait, your lord? Comma, sellsword, I think. Of course, my lord. <laughs> Godspeed, sellsword. Unless this is Lord Sells Sword, <laughs> which is another name for mercenary hired for monies. 
Okay, read the rules and when ready, click the clicker to start. Okay, so what do we got here? Got the basic IDs. Oh gosh, they look very... <laughs> they look, look like they rattle when they walk. No wizards. Okay, anybody that looks like a wizard is going to be banned, apparently. Flying wizards. We spot and then spear? Wow. Okay, so we can try this. If we see them flying from the other side... Oh, look what they've done to Mount Rushmore. There's a king and a couple of knights and a... Somebody... Maybe an apothecary. I don't know. No guns. No wizards. There is a deer over there. Nice deer. Nice beaver. What is that? Is that a bear or a beaver or a wombat? I don't know. Anyway, my mind's on Timberborn. Okay, so if we spot thing, there's a mountain goat. How nice. Oh, that's beautiful. Okay, so we got stuff. We got this thing, flying wizards, and I'll, I'm going to put our clicker over here so it's easier to click. I guess we go. This is uh, interesting. Let's let's click go. Let's do this. This is really amusing, actually. <laughs> I'm highly amused by this. ID, please. Me? Yes, you. Do you want to get in? Okay. Lillian? Yeah. Okay, good, good. I bet they have... <laughs> This. The hat matches. <laughs> Funny. I'm looking up. I, I tend to like look at this window. Oh no! Oh no! Look! The wizard! No! Okay, Sadie is here. Looks like her. I have to look up every now and again. I kind of focus around this area and that's it. Wait, what happened? Oh. Hello? Hello, Cell Sword. Let me pass. My invis spell only lets last so long. Let me pass. You owe me if I do, okay? Yes, yes, Zellsword. If I complete this mission, the veil is safe. Uh, sure. Godspeed, mage. Thank you, Zellsword. <laughs> See? <laughs> so silly. Oh no, check expiry. <laughs> is that the only problem, my dear lord? Or my lord? My lord, not my dear lord. Dear Lord would be a different expression entirely. <laughs> okay, Francesca. Uh, yeah, sure. Coming in. Yeah, hat is good. Wizard is dead. Okay, fine. All right. Oh, this. Oh, it's a squirrel. That's what it is. It's a squirrel. It looked so big and so curiously sitting. Um, yeah, you go. I I just uh, yeah. When it wiggles wiggles its tail, it's okay. Uh, all right, Isabel, sure, go in. Hello, you look like a wizard to me. Sorry, cannot. Usually the ones that we have a quest with will appear in the middle. That was like from the other game. So I'm pretty sure the one that we met earlier was our wizard or our mage, I should say. Sorry, wizard, bye-bye. 86, that's fine. Yep, good, good. Hat with horns, traditional Viking helmet, authentic TM, right there. All right, okay, we needed 11, I guess. Baker, yeah, looking good. There's another wizard in line. Oh no. Here be, <laughs> here be. Good lord. Oh, oh. 91, hat matches, hooray. Okay, we got our big goal. Good. So some of these things, like in the other game, you were given some amount of leeway. So you could like accept a bribe, uh, get in a fake ID or whatever. I like their dress, by the way. It's very cool. But you had a little bit of leeway. Like they could even, you know, they would even bribe, bribe you or whatever. And as long as you didn't fail, it was just fine. And sometimes... Even the um, the pounds here, which should be dollars. I, we, we forgot to check on the dollars last time, didn't we? Uh, I think it's dollars. But anyway, um, sometimes uh, you could choose to accept a bribe, which uh, would, inc would was more valuable than the fine that you would receive. So, yeah. Just depended. All right, here we go. 19... 
I'm actually very impressed that I'm playing this game while talking. That's pretty handy. Because <laughs> I think the first one is really much tighter on time. At least in the later levels. Maybe I, uh... I'm, maybe we're gonna get there here. Oh, no, no. Why would you have the idea of a mage, dude? Don't you know? This is, oh, maybe, maybe they're actually a mage and just dressed up as a knight. Oh, those are the worst kind of offenders. They're trying to fool us, those darn sneaky mages. Mm-hmm. Alana knight, perfect. Beautiful. Okay, oh, squirrel. Okay, good. Lois, you go in. I used to know a lady named Lois. Uh, okay, there we go. All right, hello. Hat matches. Yay, yay. Go in. We haven't really seen any fake IDs other than other than picture. Not yet, anyway. All done. Okay, this is in dollar uh, I, I, iconography, I guess. Uh, they, <laughs> great job, Cell Sword. They shall boast of your skills in feasts to come. Thank you, my lord. Here you go. The knights of the realm have a special dinner tomorrow. It's a ticketed event. Should you fancy a few extra coin in your pocket, come serve your lord. Uh, it shouldn't be pocket. It should be probably in your pouch like coin pouch hmm? yeah. one last thing sells sword we have reports of a mage gaining illegal entry <laughs> said mage cast a level five acid splash into the rum punch <laughs> we threw him out of course but it was too late for some of our most loyal knights <laughs> they spent the evening licking condensation from the stained glass window <laughs> Would you know anything about this? <laughs> that mage, he cast charm person upon me! Ah, that makes sense, Selsword. No harm done. I could tell your wisdom was low. <laughs> oh god, this is too funny for words. <laughs> we amassed quite the blackmail material. Go now, Selsword, before I change my mind. See you tomorrow. Bye-bye, my lord. <laughs> oh, God. It's best to be honest. You know, level level five. Perfect knights. Oh, I hope we can get this because I'm now worried about that. Anyway, um, I guess we explore. There's not much else that we need to do here. Uh, eh? Soon as I woke, I headed to meet Joe the mage. Working didn't leave much time for sleep. It takes its toll. Oy. There was Joe, skulking around the front grounds. You okay? Thanks for letting me in last night. Alas, the Knights had some sort of invisibility ward. They saw me right away. Sorry about that. No worries, I'm a wily one. I acid splashed the rum and stole the sacred gem of enlargement. Okay. <laughs> sacred gem of enlargement. Oh, I have no... I, I'm not going to question what that is. I now have ideas, but we're just going to skip that. You said you knew something about George. Ah, George the Sellsword. Yes, a troubled lad from a far away land. Is he still in town? No, no. He passed through on an epic journey to see the third Duke of Yorkshire. The who? You know it as New York City. It is a long, arduous trek through the arid plague lands. You mean the pandemic zone? Aye. Few routes remain, but the only entrance is through the grand city of gusty clouds. <laughs> Let me guess. Chicago, that's my guess too. Indeed, regardless, consider me in your debt. Take this mage's visor. May it protect you on your journey. We got a mask. Okay. Oh, hey. Why don't we put that on? This is a surgical mask. Nay, it is a magical mask to protect you in the plague lands. Sure. Thanks for all your help, Joe. I'll work for Lord Lupo again. His banquet could be a money spinner. Okay, so we didn't get this one. I'm really worried about that. 
but it gives us just money, I guess. Oh, maybe it's, maybe we just need to do the second day or something. Make X amount in this area. Bouncer. Okay, so let's go. Uh, take job. Ah, sellsword. You have returned to my service. Yes, my lord. Excellent, for it is a most joyous occasion. The knights of the round table assemble tonight. All knights must present a special round table ticket for entry. So this ticket is round? Nay, sellsword. Imagine the printing costs. The table is round. The tickets are rectangular, but some try to fake the tickets. You can tell my wisdom is low. How do I know that what the fakes look like? Examine the tickets. On the forgeries, the sword does not connect to the stone. Thanks for being so cryptic about a rule you want me to enforce. <laughs> God. Also, no miners or fake IDs? Correct. And no wizards. Never. Okay, okay. Let's see if we can get in here. I wonder if the Knight Perfect is making no mistakes. That would really be interesting. Okay, let's try. Here I go with my surgical mask to protect us from the plague lands. Oh boy. Anyone to come in? Anybody? Hello? Oh, this guy's going all the way to the back of the line to come in. <laughs> Hello. ID and ticket, please. All right, so let's see. This one does connect. Okay, wizard. Oh, no. Jeez, wizard flew into the tower. Oh, that's bad. Uh, hello? Sure. Oh, man, I was too busy looking at other things. Crap. Okay, so was that one's fine. There isn't a stamp. Is there supposed to be a stamp? Hold on. Day and stamp. There... Is the sword, the stone, the stamp? I can't, I don't even know. Here, there's a wizard guy. Oh. Here, let's try to let her in and see if that's okay. Because the, the stone doesn't look like a stamp, I gotta say. It just looks like a stone. Okay, go. Okay, I'm really worried that we let that wizard in. It's like, no! Uh, okay, get you. That's fine. Oh well, it's fine. Okay, so da -da 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 -da, that seems okay. I clicked in, then I was like, "Oh my god, the hat is!" I don't know if it's right. This is fine. Eighty-five. Sure. I guess the stone is meant to be the stamp. The wizards. Okay. Do, 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 do. Sure. Hat matches. There we go. Okay. There we go. Da -da -da -da. Yeah. Sure. Go. All right. I can't believe I have one already. My perfectionism is being oppressed. Okay, mm. go. Uh, okay, go in. Okay, let's see. This is fine. 84, sure. Hat, yep, good, good. Okay. 99, two, sure. Okay. Lots of knights in, of the round table here. Oh, there's no ticket at all. Go. Sure. Bye bye. I so far we haven't seen a ticket that's not correct. Maybe ticket without stamp, I guess. Oh no! Was really? I didn't even see them. Oh no. Okay. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. We won't have that many. Let's go. Let's see. There, there. Ninety nine. Sure. On this background, it's sometimes hard to see if they have horns on their helmets there. That's fine. Go. Oh no, I forgot to... Oh, darn it. This is bad. Okay. 88, 22. No, wrong hat. Sorry, dude. Oh, and I didn't... Okay. Not bothered. All right. Take it, please. Give, give. That's fine. Okay, 80. 
Sure. Okay, good, good. Alright, let's see. 90. Hair, all the things. Okay, good. Hat. Okay, good, good. Okay, closing time. I kind of got used to going fast from the first game because some of those are really tight, especially the extra bonuses. Like, you have to go fast. Like, really fast. Uh, so, yeah, I should take a little bit more time to examine things since this is a little bit looser. And we don't actually get more money for extra people, so it's fine. Okay, we did not get a warning. We got $150, so all done. Incredible cell sword bonus for you today. Thanks. Here's your coin. Our transactions are complete, cell sword. Cell sword, I have grown fond of you. Take this on your journey. Magical armor? My, my, is that a spark of interest in the medieval way of life? Here, an I. <laughs> oh, really? <laughs> an iron umbrella? Hello? What? <laughs> Although carrying swords is frowned upon, that's the next best thing. And completely useless. Like an iron umbrella would rust in five seconds. No matter where you travel, no matter what ill fortune you encounter, raise thy umbrella to the stars and show the heathens you are a knight of the realm. Or if it begins to rain. <laughs> this is so silly. Oh my god. Oh no, we didn't get... What? I am so confused. We had this stamp before, and now it's X'd? I is very confused. This is very strange. I'm going to take a screenshot and send this to uh, people on the Discord because I don't know why we have ha help. Got an iron umbrella. It's beautiful. Wow. Beautiful. Yes. Wow. We had the wizard thing. All we were missing was the perfect knights thing. But now we have the perfect knights and no wizard thing. What? Confusion. Finding this George was harder than I expected. Working didn't leave much time for sleep. I takes its toll. I spotted yeah. Joe. I'm leaving for the plague lands, Joe. Maybe I can catch George before he makes it to New York. You've brought peace to Camelot. Fare thee well, fellow mage. Mage or Grand Mage? We magic folk have enough enemies, Kevin. Let us not quibble. Keep that hate bottled for the bards. <laughs> Sellsword on your way to the grand city of gusty clouds. Do not take the I-90. Checkpoints are in place hunting out magic users such as ourselves. If challenged, mention you work for Lupo. His name carries weight with knights. Okay, thanks again, Joe. I've had a good time here, but it's time to go. This is... Urgh, this... Right, no, why? I, it's almost as if they shifted to the left. Is that correct? I don't know. Because I wonder if I had to have a perfect knight at the at the knight place. Perfect knight? Uh, I don't know. We'll see. Let's leave. George was heading to New York City. Chicago was on the border of the pandemic zone and the gateway further east. That's my next step. I heard the familiar sounds of the Mapo drone overhead. The speaker buzzed as a care package was released into my arms. Thanks! Fulfilling Mapo Quest helps us reestablish liberty in America. Mapo Quest 1 success. You aced both knights at Camelot. Mapo 2 Quest success. Joe was allowed into Camelot. Yay health! Mapo Quest 3 incomplete. No bonus morale. No! It was complete. You cheated, game! B grade achieved. Wait, did what did he say here? You aced both knights at Camelot. Okay, so I did earn money. I did get to the bonus. Both bonuses. Both knights at Camelot. So I did get that one. I don't get this one at all. Nye? Mapo Quest 3. I don't remember what... I thought the mage was made. Anyway. Game cheated. Anyway. There were two routes to get to Chicago, but now for now, Kevin's road trip ends here. Thanks for taking the time to- What? No! no I'm, not, I'm not done yet. I want to play more. 
Help! Nein! No! No! This is the end of the American dream for you. For now. Thanks for playing the Not Tonight 2 demo. We can't wait for you to start your journey to save Eduardo and travel the not-so-United States later this year. To be the first to know about the game's release, make sure to wishlist us over on Steam and join the Discord for news, metagame fun, and sneak previews of the full game. So, anyway, I hope you have enjoyed this uh, preview of the game. I'm really, really looking forward to this. I like this game. I think it's fun. I like... It's very different as you as if you've played the first game, it's very different from that, uh, which that one is a little bit more repetitive, but has its own kind of like uh, rhythm to it. This seems fun because we have the metagame. It's really interesting. And uh, anyway, I hope you have enjoyed uh, these videos and uh, yeah, keep following along for when this game releases. So thank you so very much for joining me. Take care of yourselves and each other and I'll see you next time.